To find the oxidation number for each element here in NH2 minus the amide ion, we use these rules here. First off, we notice we have this negative charge here. So when we have a negative charge, we have an ion. And all the oxidation numbers for the compound here, they're going to add up to the charge of the ion. So all the oxidation numbers here are going to add up to minus 1. So we can set it up an equation where everything equals minus 1. Hydrogen, when it's bonded to a nonmetal, that's going to have positive one oxidation number on each of the hydrogen. Nitrogen, we don't know that. It can have different oxidation states depending on what it's bonded to. Let's just call it X. So we're going to say X plus one times two, that's two, that equals the minus one. We subtract two from each side and we get X equals minus three. So the oxidation number on the nitrogen in NH2 minus, that is going to be minus 3. If you add these numbers up, 2 times plus 1, that's plus 2, plus 2 and minus 3, that gives us that minus 1. This is Dr. B with the oxidation numbers for the amide ion, NH2 minus. Thanks for watching.